What's up, guys? We're back again with another episode of The Office. This time, episode number three. The first two episodes were very great. I really enjoyed them a lot, and I can see why people really love this show. I'm starting to like it a lot, and um, I just can't wait to see this episode. So we're gonna just jump straight up into this one. So let's go. There's nothing new. That's all you said earlier. Oh, do you want me to repeat the messages that I gave you before for the... Hmm. The most sacred thing I do is care and provide for my workers, my family. I give them money. I give them food. Not directly, but through the money. I heal them. Today, I am in charge of picking a great new health care plan, right? That's what this is all about. Does that make me their doctor? Um, yes. You gotta crack these You know, the whole open. reason that we're doing this mm -hmm. is to save money. So, you just need to pick a provider and then choose the cheapest plan. Well, that is... A kind of a tough assignment. Um, it's not going to be a popular decision job. around the old orifice. So I, well, it's a suicide mission, you know? <laughs> Michael, I, I don't... I, maybe, I mean, I, there, there, you know, sometimes a manager like yourself has to deliver the bad news to the employees. I do it all the time. Oh, yeah, when have so you ever done that? I'm doing it right now. Last night on training classes. There's, have you seen it? No, I have a life. Interesting. What's that like? You should try it sometime. Wow. But then you would watch my TV. <laughs> There's a decision that needs to be made, and I'm having an unbelievably busy day. Um, so I'm going to let you pick a health care plan for our office. Well, puts the responsibility off on somebody else. To your coworkers. Gosh. I really think I should be concentrating on sales. Really? Yeah. I just don't think that this is the kind of task that I am going to do. You know who would be great for this? Anytime Michael asks me to do anything, I just tell him that Dwight should do it. Yes, I can do it. I'm your man. Well, he's jumping right in. Now, this, and, uh, well, if this were my career, I'd have to throw myself in front of a train. Ooh. Okay, first, let's go over some parameters. How many people can I hire? Uh, none. You're picking a health care plan. Okay, we'll table that for the time being. If Dwight fails, then that is strike two, and good for me, for, uh, for giving him a second chance. And if he succeeds, then, you know, no one will be prouder than I am. I've groomed him. I made him what he is today. Unless he fails, and uh, we talked about that already. What did I do? I did my job. I slashed benefits to the bone. I saved this company money. Was I too harsh? Maybe. Scary. I don't believe in coddling people. In the wild, there is no health care. In the wild, health care is how I hurt my leg. I can't run. A lion eats me, and I'm dead. Well, I'm not dead. I'm the lion. Mm -hmm. I have to make a call after I finish my work. You know what? Um, just don't let anybody in my office under any conditions today. I'm just too busy, too swamped, you know? I am unreachable. I am incommunicado, capiche? Yeah, you're okay. trying to avoid everybody. Thank you. Oh, God, here we go again. Got to go. I have to take this. Still no one calling. It's embarrassing. Sure. Well, why did you do that? You work here. Don't you want good insurance? Don't need it. Never been sick. Perfect immune system. Okay, well, if you've never been sick, then you don't have any antibodies. I don't need them. Superior genes. I'm a shrewd. And superior brain power. Through concentration, I can raise and lower my cholesterol as well. What? Why would you want to raise your cholesterol? So I can lower it. What? Which, uh, which one? Right, healthcare member. I told you about it. Is it a good plan? It's a great plan. Saves the company a fortune. It's like a pay decrease. Michael, he made huge cuts. Cuts? What? Wow, Dwight, did you make cuts? Yeah, you said no, 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 no. You know what? I said nothing specific because I was so busy. Why don't you go in there, Dwight, 
and find these people a plan that'll work for them. Okay? I can handle it. Okay. Man, he's trying to pay you, right. buddy. We feel good? All right. There's some other good news. Today, at the end of the day, I will have, for all of you, a big surprise. Okay? So hang in there, and I will see you at the end of the day. Okay. Do I know what the surprise is? Hello? Doesn't matter. The point is, they are not unhappy anymore. They're out there thinking, wow, my boss really cares about me. He yeah. has a surprise. He's cool. I, what a great guy. I love him. I love him. What I'd like you to do is to fill this out and write down any diseases you have that you might want covered and we'll see what I can do. Yeah, you know what, Dwight? We can't write our diseases down for you because that's confidential. Okay, well, I didn't say to write your name down, did I? Fill it out, leave it anonymous. You know what? Come with me. We are going on a little mission. Operation Surprise. Where are you going? Um, headed out. Part of my busy day, you know. Meetings. They have this thing where they send a bus, right, for free. Picks everybody up. You head down there, get to the hotel. Room is cocked. They give you a big pile of chips and your food. Everything's just kind of all-inclusive, free kind of weekend. I don't know of anything like that. But, um, you know, what you might want to do is just call those casinos directly. Oh, uh, maybe? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, I did, so... I want to ask you a little favor, Rooney, my friend. Uh, trying to give the troops around here a little bit of a boost, and I was thinking that maybe we could take them down to take a spin on your big ride. You mean the elevator that takes you down in the mine shaft? It's not really a ride. Uh, it says here that it's a, a 300 foot drop. Well, it goes 300 feet into the earth, but it moves really slowly. So it's not a free fall. It's an industrial coal elevator. Uh, all right. Well, once you get down into the mine, what do you, you got laser tag or something? Oh. Uh, someone uh, forged medical information and that's a felony. Okay, whoa. All right, because that's a pretty intense accusation. Yeah. How do you know that they're fake? Uh, leprosy, flesh-eating bacteria, hot dog fingers. <laughs> Government-created killer nanorobot infection. What? You did this, didn't you? Absolutely not. Yes, you did. You know what I mean? I know it was you. Okay, fine. You know what? I'm going to have to interview each and every one of you until the perpetrator makes him or herself known. And until that time, there will be no health care coverage for anyone. The problem, Jim, mm -hmm. is that people who are really suffering from a medical condition won't receive the care they need because someone in this office is coming up with all this ridiculous stuff. Count Choculitis. <laughs> Why did you write that down, Jim? What? Is it because you know I love Count Chocula? Do you? What? Those are my keys. Good luck. What? Jim! Damn it! Oh, no! he's locking him in. Jim, let me out! Jim, let <laughs> You kind of deserve it. Light green. That's horrible! Oh. Mm. <laughs> Thanks, Dwight, for a crappy plan. Ah, oh, damn! Oh, mm, I wish I had time to change it, but uh, Jane needs it by five, and what time is it? What time is it? Twelve. Oh, after five. Uh, uh, oh, it's awful. So, well, okay. See you guys uh, on Monday. What about the surprise? Oh, yes, exactly. Thank you, Angela, for reminding me. This is embarrassing. Oh, this is embarrassing. Stalin. Oh, um, Jan 
frequency to call her. Oh, on top of everything. Well, that was a good episode. So that was the office episode three, and just like the first two, this was a great episode. Man, that was entertaining. I mean, if you're really having a bad day or just really feeling down, you need to watch this show because they'll really pep you up. This is a very good show. I'm enjoying it, and I'm very happy I started this series. And um, like I say, just keep stay with me, join me for this ride, and um, it's like it's gonna be a fun one. I'm glad to have this show in the rotation. I'm gonna try to do it. As regular as I can. And um, yeah, like I say, I'm enjoying it. Hit me up in the comments and let me know what you thought about this episode. Because this, this was a great one. And I really love this like quiet kind of humor it has. It's not no music going on, no soundtrack, uh, no laugh track and then going on. It's just really quiet and just kind of easy humor. It's, it's great. So hit me up in the comments. Let me know what you thought about it. And um, hit the like button if you like this video. And if you really like it. Hit that subscribe button and join this community and help this community grow. And I'll see you on the next one.